The uh, members of the Taliban regime in Kabul attended an online course from IIM Kozi Kode organized through the Ministry of External Affairs. Arindam Bakhti on Thursday said there has been no change in its position on not recognizing the Taliban regime in Kabul. He also stated that there was no official diplomatic communication regarding this. Mr. Arindam Bakhti further stated that the Indian side does not issue any note uh, verbal to any entities that are not recognized by New Delhi. Major Mohammad Ali Shah, defense expert, is still with us on the broadcast. Ali, important to note that India, perhaps not spelling it out completely, uh, has affirmed and confirmed that uh, we recognize the Taliban. Well, Vineet, uh, though Mr. Arindam Bakshi has said that we still, I mean, our stand on them still remains uh, very clear. I would tell you it's a way of, it's called the taming of the shrew. Like uh, there's this novel, I'm sure most of us would have read, The Taming of the Shrew. So we uh, actually, we would want them, because IM is the number one uh, uh, management school in the in the country. I had the fortune of going to IM Calcutta. So I am cozy code when uh, the hooligans from Taliban, I would call them, when they attend a course, at least there would be some grooming, some change, some effective, something we will see because they kept claiming that they have uh, become uh, the, a new Taliban, a fresh Taliban. But our stand still remains the same, actually. I mean, I don't think uh, there would be any uh, change. But yes, uh, regarding your question, do we recognize them or not? Well, it's not about recognizing, it's about taming No, the them. bigger question, Ali, is should we recognize them or not, considering what the Taliban has been doing uh, to its own population, especially to girl children? Should ever uh, recognize them beneath, and we would be uh, making a folly there if we do that, because they will never change, and never, the leopard never changes the sports. And they will remain the same, no matter whether we send them to IIT or IIM or we send them wherever. One of their ministers was uh, trained at the Indian Military Academy, in fact. And so I don't think uh, we should give them. That's my perception. Of course, the government is welcome to take their own uh, stand, and they they should be, and it should be respected by everyone. There's no doubt about that. But my personal belief is the leopard doesn't change its spots, and we are trying our best to groom them. We are trying our best people to do whatever because now. We have to live with it. You, there's no other option. You can't really, by turning your face away, by keeping a blind eye, by you will, you will only be behaving like an ostrich. So, or like a pigeon who closes his eyes and see and think that that's the world. But the reality is the Taliban is ruling the roost in Afghanistan. And we have had investments made in Afghanistan, not just financially, but emotionally, physically, in every way possible. And to keep that relationship growing, we have to somehow, somewhere, keep the channel of communication open. If we break the channel of communication completely, then uh, it will. That is not the solution. So yes, now the question, the golden question: Do we give the recognition? My personal take. That's my personal take. Is no, we. I mean, uh, they will not change. But yes, we can always try to somewhere make them milder and tame them slightly. All right.